All right, I'm going to walk you through how to print labels in Word using a list in Excel. So the first thing I want to do is create a new document. All right, now that I have a blank document, I'm going to come here to the Mailings tab. I'm going to go to Start Mail Merge and pick Labels. Then I have to pick my label manufacturer and my label size. I know we use Avery 5160 so that's what I have it set for. Tell it OK. Inserts my labels here. You can see the grid lines. These may not show up if you want to see. These grid lines here may not show up if you want to see them. Just come here to the layout tab. This view grid lines button will make them show up and disappear. I like to see them so I'm going to leave them there. Come back to your mailings tab and now I have to select my recipients. I'm going to use an existing list and I have to tell it where my list is. I know on my desktop I have a file here called Some Workers. I'm going to open that up. Tell it what sheet to use. Alright, so now it just imported my list. You don't see anything yet because we haven't added any fields. So I'm going to come here to Insert Merge Field. And every column that's on my table is now a field here uh, that I can insert onto my labels. So the first thing I'm going to add is first name. Then any characters you type on the labels are going to show up. So uh, I put a space in here. I add last name. Then I hit return to put a new line in. Address line one, space. Address line two, another return city comma state and zip so that's everything I want on my labels I'm gonna click update labels and it's gonna move those fields to all the different labels and finally I click preview results and there are my labels done and done